I'm not gonna cry on this internet. I'm not gonna cry over here. Cause who does that? Like, and I have the camera in my face, like, and it's not cute, girl. <laughs> Or should I say, I don't know what to say, but I'm happy to be talking to you guys again. I'm not even gonna pull up and act like like we've been kicking it every day. Like I know I've been MIA for like five months. Yeah. And you know, I don't know, had a baby child, had a baby y'all. Who told me to have a baby again, girl? It's giving ghetto, but I'm loving it. Don't, don't, don't. Let this shit fool you. I love my babies, which makes me love being a mom. And I'm gonna start posting again soon, 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 soon. I'm gonna try to get it together. I'm trying to get get out of this lazy funk, and I'm I'm tired of being sad. Sometimes I be sad, and and there's absolutely nothing wrong with me. Like I be so happy. Like everything is good. Like I'm straight. Like I'm grateful as hell but i'll have like an hour where i'm like super overstimulated and i'm just sad for no reason nothing there's and then there's nothing that anybody else nobody can do i just be sitting in my funk like just leave me alone and i just come back out but i'll be having those moments and i'm just like god what is wrong with me but i just need to talk to god more i'm trying to build a better relationship with god and i get spiritual 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 is that how it's supposed to sound it sound like i'm saying speed with ritual spiritual i don't know bro i don't know how it's supposed to sound right now but it sounds good it's like a butt chin but it's just a scar i'm gonna get rid of it though um but yeah i'm gonna get um i'm trying to i have 550 subscribers right now and i want at least a thousand so i'm gonna need y'all to help me get there and I know it's not about all about the subscribers. I really want people to engage. So I really want you to subscribe if you like the content that I post or if you want to see something or if you like me. I don't want you to subscribe to me just because you know me or because I'm telling you to subscribe. I really actually want an engagement and I actually want you to just, you know, want to support. If you actually want to support me, support my shit. I ain't going to tell you to stop now. But anyways, you know, and you might not like everything that I post. It might not relate to you. It might not be something that you want. Like, I follow a lot. I subscribe to a lot of people, and I don't wear wigs. But I subscribe to them, and I don't watch the wig videos. But I like the other part of the content that they do, you know, post. So, when I say post, that sounded so not me. But, yeah. So, I just, I mean, if, if it's that, you'd be like, oh, I don't like it. Just subscribe. So, yeah, just subscribe. <laughs> um, anyways, so, you know, everything you do, you have a goal. You work out, you got to go. You you go to work, you got to go. So, I'm trying to, and it's not like that, but it's like that. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. Let's, let's, let me gain like 600. I have 550. Let me just get a little bit of over 1,000. Even if it's 1,001, like, can we do that? Can we do that? Please. Okay, so. Share with your mommy, your papi, your grandma, all of them. Your baby, your baby daddy, all of them. Tell them to subscribe. Like, and I want, I want, and it's not your friend. Like, my friends are very supportive. You know what I'm saying? But I actually want, like, they. I already know they like me because we're friends. Like, I'm trying to see who else, who else is willing to engage with me. Let's, let's connect. And if you have a channel as well, because I'm here to support you, drop your channel names and... I want to see what you're talking about. Like, if I like some of the content that you do post, I'm going to go ahead and subscribe. You know what I'm saying? Because, you know, you know, it's a hobby. So, are we doing this? Are we doing this? I don't know um, what it is, but this person don't want to turn. Anyways, I'm on my way. My, I'm all close to the camera and shit, but let me put my phone down. I need to be more organized with this mess. But the, per the person before did not win a turn. So, <laughs> now I'm stuck. Okay. Let me turn on my shit. Okay. Can you please go? And my scary behind is not going to go when the car is too close. I got to mentally prepare for it. This nigga just snuck behind. All right, I'm going. Let's go. I'm on my 
my way to take my son to surgery. I need to put my phone down. This is not safe. I'm, I'm going to get back to y'all. All right. Um, I had to hurry up and I just got to be safe for everybody's sake. <laughs> um, it's, it's okay. Yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get back to y'all. But he's just having a circumcision. I don't want to keep y'all waiting. It's just circumcision, but we couldn't do it because I had COVID when I was giving birth. So here we are. And I actually had to, they called me. It was like, oh, um, we got to schedule your son's surgery. And I was just like, surgery? So that's like my mind. Like, I know it's just a circumcision. But my mind is like, I know he's going to be in pain. So I'm just, I was emotional earlier that took you know but let me just tend to him real quick um i want to comfort him before the actual you know he's not, he's i don't want him to be annoyed now and be in pain later okay so you remember y'all remember oh okay so before i get to that i took out that little stain that was on my scarf i noticed that i was like girl you're going out bad <laughs> isn't he lovely Anyways, um, yeah, basically they have like a fire alarm drill going on on the four and five. I'm on three. That's what the announcement was all about. So, but yeah, I'm going to keep praying. They, I'm still waiting. Like I didn't pray. Now I'm just trying to get it over with. It's so my, my nerves can relax. It's still going to be up, but like the anticipation. <laughs> can kill nah it's like not but um let me not bore y'all with this i'm not doing nothing so i don't want to just have y'all just sitting here with me <sighs> i'm not gonna sit here and cry on this internet but so they did not tell me that i was not gonna be there I don't know if they missed that or I missed it. Like, maybe I didn't have enough questions. So he had a consult. That's why it was such a big deal. He had to have a consultation before this surgery day, two weeks prior. And they did not tell me that I was not going to be able to be there. So they took him. And they're like, they're going to be back in 25 minutes. I'm not going to cry over here. Because who does that? Like, and I have the camera in my face. Like, and it's not cute, girl. <laughs> But, um, she came and just took him, bruh, like, let me get out of here. Okay, so, I wasn't, I don't know if things change. When my brother was born, who's 19, damn, and I remember that to this day, because I, I felt grown as hell. Don't ask me how old I am, I'm not that old, but I'm not that young either. Apparently, and he was circumcised the second day after my mom gave birth, and we were all there. So that's literally the image that I had. But in the consultation, they didn't. They didn't tell me that I wasn't gonna be able to be there. Like, like, what are y'all doing? Like, it's really, it's really a surgery at this point because I can't be there. I'm gonna get back to y'all. My daughter she's two so she's a whole nother baby i know she's two but she's a she's extra baby like she's gonna be touching i'm glad i wish he was here but you know she would have made things way worse if y'all know her she's just really busy she's just really busy and she's really curious and she don't like no for an answer so she's gonna be into stuff 
so that's why they couldn't come and she has a dental appointment so uh, I guess I'll take this shift and yeah but he's a little calmer now I don't know I guess because I was crying I don't know he's in pain though but imagine the people that actually have to the people that actually have to go through this like they have cancer they have so many different health issues that I can't even name because I'm not even educated on that route we gotta really just try our best like to be nice to people you don't know what they're going through you don't know the things that they have to overcome and yes people will try you and and I'm working on putting people in their place without having to like you know in an educating way so that way they learn and not do that to somebody else instead of trying to damage them you know what I'm saying so yeah he feels a little bit better now so I'm gonna just sleeping I just had to make sure he was breathing I'm gonna have to keep checking on his breathing but I'm gonna, I'm gonna just end this video right here yeah I'll get back with y'all I literally had to beg the doctor to remind me of all the post-op requirements and if I didn't, I don't know where my son would be right now, but he's totally fine now. Thank you for all the prayers.